What's up guys, I'm Eric here and today we're going to talk about 8 ways that you can make any exercise harder. Now before we start, technique and form is really important. If you do any of these and your technique or form breaks down, take one step back, work on that, then progress to the next one. And so if you want to make an exercise easier, you can just do the opposite of what we're going to talk about today. So the first way that you can make an exercise harder is by increasing the number of repetitions. For example, if you're doing 8 to 10 reps of push-ups, you can move it to 20, 25 or even more and this is going to change the adaptation that you're going to get and it's going to be more of muscle endurance rather than strength and hypertrophy. However, if you are in the hypertrophy phase of your program, you can do number two which is increasing the number of sets. This way you're going to get the type of adaptation that you want. So for example, if you're doing for hypertrophy and you're doing 8 to 10 reps, you can do instead of doing three sets of uh, 8 to 10, you can do 4, 5 or even more sets of 8 to 10. So by increasing the number of sets instead of repetitions, you can still aim for the rep range for the specific adaptation that you want and still making the exercise harder, especially in the last couple of sets that you're going for. The third way that you can make an exercise harder is by reducing the rest time. Again, this slight increasing the repetition moves your adaptation more toward muscle endurance. If that's not something you want, you're better off with increasing the number of sets rather than reducing the rest time. The fourth way to make an exercise harder is by increasing the resistance. And for that, you can use weights or a resistance band. For example, in push-up, you can put a weight plate on your back or wear a weighted vest or you can use a resistance band like this, wrap it around your neck and doing the exercise. Okay. Couple of notes about the resistance bands. The more tension in the band, the harder it's gonna get. So if you wanna start with no tension, it's gonna be easier than if you start with some tension and if you have multiple bands like this, you can add them together and perform the exercise and that's gonna be harder than either of them alone. Or you can use one band and fold it like this and that's gonna double the resistance right there. The next way that you can make an exercise harder by adding instability to the exercise. For example, in push-up, you can use a teeter board to do the push-ups on and make it unstable or you can lift one leg and make it unstable with that leg. This way you're increasing the activity of your stabilizer muscles which increases the demand for the exercise. However, if you want to improve your strength, it's not a good way to make an exercise harder because you cannot reach your max strength when you are unstable. So if you want to improve your max strength, it's better to use weights rather than stability to make an exercise harder. Another way that you can make an exercise harder is by changing the pace or tempo of the exercise. You can do it in two ways. You can either go slower or you can go faster and make it explosive. And these two have different types of adaptations. With slow movements, you're gonna improve your neuromuscular control. With fast movements, you're going to improve your explosive power. Another way that you can make an exercise harder is by changing the variation of that exercise. For example, instead of doing double leg, you can do single leg. Or in case of push-ups, instead of doing two arm push-ups, you can do one arm push-up. Or you can do incline or decline push-ups. This way, you're going to change the mechanics and how you're going to load the muscle, which increases the demand of the exercise and make it harder. And the last way that you can make an exercise harder is by changing the type of sets that you're doing. So for example, you can do drop set, which you perform a set number of repetition with a weight. And after that, you reduce the weight and perform another set of repetitions, then you reduce the weight again and perform another set number of repetitions. Those are eight ways that you can use to make an exercise harder. Hope you like them and implement them into your own workout, especially during these times that we don't have as many options that we used to in order to challenge ourselves and improve our performance. 
If you're looking for a scientific exercise program designed specifically for your body and fitness level that delivers the result that you want, make sure to check out our programs at mnyp.com. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or want me to cover a specific topic, leave it in the comments and I will do my best to do that for you. That is it for this video. Hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.